Welcome to a new video from the parts channel, well, I'm going to make a short video. But I find it very interesting, answering a question that. You have left me, have you received a Peugeot 1600E with a broken turbo at the workshop? Due to clogging of the lubrication bolt filter? Let's see, the truth is that yes. We have had many broken turbos in the workshop, because the strainer of this bolt, which is the turbo lubrication bolt, had been clogged. The engine oil comes out towards the turbo. They have two bolts, one that is this, the one that is screwed to the engine, which has that strainer. And then there is another one that is screwed to the turbo itself, but that one does not have it, now that's it they don't. Have any, okay? In the past, I don't remember if it was 2007 or 2008, they began to remove these filters. Because they were causing problems, these filters, with the dirt that accumulates on them. Dirt that the oil that enters carries with it out there to lubricate the turbo, and it can clog it, and in fact, they clogged it. Another thing is why this dirt got there, how it was formed, which could be because the oil was badly degraded, or because the timings were not respected, oil change, etc., but hey, the engine already has a sieve for that. In the crankcase oil sucker itself and then apart, it has an oil filter. That should do the job of cleaning the oil, but this part, as I said. This sieve has caused more damage than it has prevented, in fact, there were other companies, such as Mazda or Ford, that assembled these same engines and they did not put that sieve on them. Because they knew perfectly well that this could cause damage to the turbos. And when a client asks me, if I advise you to remove that sieve, I say yes. But it is my advice, each one with the engine of his car to do what he wants, but I already say, that this has caused more damage than it has prevented, well, here I leave you this short video. If it has been useful to you, then do not forget to give a like and subscribe to the channel.